Hey YouTube, Peterbilt Knife Guy. Today is going to be a update on a badass Bowie knife. This is the uh, Topps Longhorn Bowie. Bowie, Bowie, I can never say it right. But, um, and this is crooked. Um, it is a badass knife. This thing is a big fat chunk of 1095 American made. Big old handle, lots of real estate. But it comes with a stupid ass sheath. Um, in my unboxing video of this, um, <laughs> I stated how bad I mean, bad this sheath is. For a knife like this, um, this is not a tactical knife in my opinion. So why would get, they give it a tactical uh, sheath for some reason with two retention straps that are Velcro and a freaking pocket? I, I don't get it. It makes no sense to me. In my opinion, a Bowie knife needs a leather sheath. So I made one. This is what I came up with. Dun, 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 dun. Bam. It's busy, but it's bitching. Did a little, this is my first attempt ever of making an inlay. Um, not my best work, but by far my worst, or not my worst. Um, they sell these little snakeskin, uh, I don't know, patterns. It's actually leather, but it's stamped and dyed to look like a uh, snakeskin. They make it like alligator and all kinds of other stuff. I went with snake because that's what I had. But I mean, then again, snakeskin on a Bowie knife, it matches. But, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's not finished. I ended up going with, uh, Chicago screws for the, uh, instead of rivets, um, mainly because I couldn't get pop rivets at my local store that were long enough to go through all this leather. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, plus the top layer and the, uh, what do you call it? The snake layer too. So yeah, it's not finished yet. I still have to seal it and burnish the edges and I might have to you know, hit a couple parts with dye again. Now it's drying. You can see where I went in heavy and I went in light, so I might have to do a second coat, but it's getting late out here and I just wanted to kind of get a video up of this, but uh, yeah, man, I think this looks fantastic compared to the original one and it has a nice snug fit. Very snug. It hasn't, you need, to bro you need to break these in, but uh, Little snap there we go that is what a what a Bowie knife should look like in my opinion I tried to uh, you know the, 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 the handle has a contour so I tried to go with the contour of the handle for the, uh, the belt loop um, yeah I'm I'm stoked and I haven't even got to use it yet and I yeah but I really was starting to not like this knife a little bit just because I was carrying around in this. But now, now that this is done or close to it, I am a lot more happy with it. And uh, now she can be carried. Anyways, thanks for watching. Have a good day.